welcome back to my welcome welcome to, back to my video vlog and uh, today today I'm gonna teach you how to do heel flip and uh, last last episode someone was asking me if I can do a tutorial how to do how to do kick flip and I did all the different variations of kick flips uh, straight kick flip switch flip fake flip and nolly flip uh, kick flip switch kick flip nolly kick flip and uh, and uh, fake kick flip and uh, actually today uh, I was planning to uh, I was planning to uh, do one new trick and uh, film, film all the process how to do how to do uh, film all the process how to do how to do and learn new trick and actually uh, 2020 beginning of 2020 when I uh, started to do well I started to do selfies and selfies and different different uh, videos about my skateboarding and uh, I was I was trying to learn uh, an alley kick flip uh, backside 270 out from that trick but somehow it really went and it was dope and uh, it was dope and I couldn't do that trick and uh, I still haven't been doing that trick on the on the curb I have been doing that trick on the ledges that goes down uh, I have been doing that trick to those ledges but but someday I'm gonna also learn that trick to to curb but uh, today I'm way too I'm way too tired today because uh, on Saturday I was skating three I was skating three hours on Saturday so my legs are legs are so tired uh, because of because of that and also also uh, first I was I was thinking I'm gonna First, I was thinking I'm gonna rest, only rest today, and uh, not not film, not film anything. But uh, but at the end, but at the end, uh, I decided that I'm gonna teach you how to do heel flip today, and uh, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do different variations of heel flip today. And usually, usually I like to do heel flips when I have a new board and new shoes, and the flip is good. But uh, today my board is. Uh, maybe not, maybe not that, maybe not that good, and uh, I don't have that much, that that much flick. But of course, I can, I can still do heel flips. And uh, also, after after the last episode, when I saw it to you how to do kick flip, I was, I, was, I, I had uh, one or two weeks, two weeks break before that because I was having injury and also new shoes and new board. So usually. Usually uh, aiming kick clips after after that is not that easy. So I think I'm gonna also do. Uh, I'm also gonna show you again how to do how to do kick clips and uh, after that I'm gonna also do those heel clips. And uh, unfortunately, I think I'm not gonna do today any new tricks. I'm not gonna do any new tricks today. Uh, like I was first planning to. I was first planning because uh, my legs and. Um, my back is uh, tired at the moment uh, because uh, on Saturday somehow my sessions went a little bit overdoing and crazy and it was impossible to uh, plan some tricks and uh, I think I'm, I'm going to do a little bit easier, easier sessions today and, and uh, like, like last episode also this episode I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to uh, stretch and warm up and then start, then, then, then start feeling and uh, then start, then start filming and uh, and uh, show you how to how to do my heel flips. But before that, I'm gonna stretch and warm up. All right, no, all right, no. So, all right, so now now the warm up and uh, warm up and uh, stretching is complete. And now uh, I, I have been here now a little bit over two minutes, still, still not half half a minute, and my legs are warm enough to do those basic flat front tricks and like i said before i'm gonna uh, do those kick flips and uh, fake flips and a switch flip i'm gonna do kick flip switch kick flip uh nolly kick flip and fake flip a little bit better than last time but so now i have been skating with this with these shoes and that new board uh, i have been now skating 
three three sessions with this with with this setup or maybe four four sessions. So my flip control is a little bit better at the moment, and I, I think I can aim a little bit better. So first I'm gonna do those kick flips kick flips a little bit better, and like you can see the foot positions. Last episode you can see all the foot positions and uh, and uh, how to put how to put your legs and. Uh, well, I can actually show it too again, and uh, and uh, usually, usually, this is the stance that I do my I do my uh, straight kick flip and uh, switch flip and nolly flip from 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 here, and uh, also nolly flip almost the same position and fake flip, fake flip also almost the same position. And uh, and uh, now I'm gonna do those kick flips, and then let's start with those with those heel flips, and let's see how that goes. And I'm gonna put my uh, some sometimes in here it, in here it's hard to find any any places to put your phone, but usually people don't skate this obviously that much. So today I'm gonna just put my phone in there and do the flat ground tricks in 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 that area. And uh, let's hope the angle is good. And uh, let's let's hope the angle is good, and the people can understand the tricks and also learn those tricks. And uh, also, there's once in a while there is difficulties to film those selfies because those uh, one of them is to put your phone in that that fence uh, and film those tricks from there. But uh, Bracket, there is not that many options because the flat ground is so bad on that on that side of the that side of the skate park and there is some like uh, like this this line in there that is not stable and there is some bump so it I don't like to feel this on that side of that curve so it's a little bit more difficult and uh, so usually I, I always wanna film all the tricks to this this side of the this side of the curve because the flat ground is it's better and uh, it's easier to aim and uh, it's a little bit easier to do the tricks. But now let's 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 see how those kick flips are going again. Flips and switch flip, kick flip and uh, switch, switch kick flip and uh, fake flip, fake kick, fake kick flip and uh, nolly kick flip again. A little bit better than last time and uh, I started all over again like so many, so many years and so many months and so many weeks. But anyway, uh, today it went a little bit better and uh, I was I was able to aim a little bit better and uh, now let's let's get down for those those heel flips and uh, let's get down for those heel flips and uh, first I'm, I'm gonna show you my foot position before I start before I start filming it and uh, so basically usually uh, usually if I do regular stance heel flip I put my my legs my front leg is usually this position and my back foot is 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 in this position and uh, then I uh, well I'm gonna show it I'm gonna show it to you how to do it but this is my foot foot position how I how I pop it and uh, also fake heel flip I do it a little bit different I do it like this and uh, switch heel flip that is 
a little bit more simple for me than a uh, regular heel flip. I don't know why I do that more often, and usually I do it do it like do it like this. This is my foot position. How I do how I do my uh, switch heel flip, and also also not null heel flip. Usually I do it from from here like this or sometimes like this it, de it depends and uh, and uh, kick flip usually I, I flick it like uh, from from like uh, like that like that and uh, heel flip heel flip you do it like like uh, uh, well it's got it's a little bit hard to explain how you how I how I do it but uh, it's a little bit complicated to uh, demonstrate how I do my heel flip. I think it's easier if I just do it. If I, I if I just do those heel flips and uh, I, uh, maybe I put some slow motion videos or something, so you can see how my legs are and my ankles are are, are going. And uh, like I said, like I said before, uh, usually I don't do uh, regular heel flip that often. Uh, Nolly heel flip I do kind of a lot, and I also switch heel flips uh, once in a while. Actually, nolly heel flip is nolly, nolly heel flip is one of my favorite tricks. Uh, normal heel flip, uh, uh, I, I don't do, like. I said I don't do that that often. And the fake fake heel flip is it's it's a little bit scary to do. And uh, sometimes when I do fake heel flip, I in my mind I am thinking uh, nolly heel flip position. Because nolly heel flip is so much easier for me than, than normal heel flip. And also, uh, it depends. Like some, day, some days, I feel like switch, switch kick flip and switch heel flip. It's more, it's more like uh, uh, I feel more co confidence to do switch heel flip or switch kick flip. And uh, sometimes I, I feel like I want to do nolly flip and nolly heel flip. And basically, when you well, I can I can show it to you. But uh, first, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start with a uh, regular heel flip, and usually uh, that's not the easiest heel flip for me. Usually, uh, easiest heel flip is null heel flip for me, and uh, second easiest usually it's uh, switch heel flip, and uh, third third easiest is usually regular heel flip and fake heel flip is is definitely. Um, most difficult for, trick for me, and I don't do uh, uh, fake heel flips that often. But uh, I know that I can do all those heel flips, and uh, and uh, I've been here now 41, 41 minutes. And like I said before, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit tired after skating three hours two days ago. And yesterday I was I was resting, but my body is still, still a little bit tired. And uh, now let's see how those heel flips are. Let's see how those heel flips are going. And usually when I have uh, he for heel flips, usually I like if my shoes are uh, like uh, maybe two or three days old, two days old shoes or three days old shoes, and new grip tape or, or new board. Usually, usually with good with good uh, with good uh, grip tape and. Uh, that's good stats and uh, like uh, good flick. Usually, it's easier to do heel flips when you when you when you can feel your board better than than uh, and you can feel your your grip tape and your board and your shoes. But now let's 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 go down for for those heel flips. And I, like I said before, I'm gonna start with regular heel flips. So that was my regular heel flip, and uh, like I said before, today I'm having my grip tape is not that good at the moment, and also my shoes, the flick is not it's not perfect at the moment, but it's it's, it's good good enough. And that was my my heel flip, and uh, I hope that everyone can see it from that that video how it goes, and maybe I also put some slow motion and like 
like before, like I have, like 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 I have been say, like I have been saying all the time. I hope people can people can also learn for for those tricks and how how those tricks tricks are going. And I'm not saying everyone should do heel flips and kick flips like that, but if it helps it, I I hope people can I hope people can learn it. And that was my regular heel flip, and uh, next I'm gonna do. Next, next I'm gonna do. Uh, maybe I next, uh, maybe next I'm doing fake heel flip. And usually that that one is usually that one is most most difficult heel flip for me. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do fake heel flip next, and uh, let's see how that goes. And uh, some 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 ways uh, some, somehow I need to think it a little bit differently than. Like uh, in my mind, I need to think nullie heel flip when I'm doing fake heel flip uh, uh, because uh, nullie heel flip is so much more logical for me than fake heel flip. But I can also I can also do fake heel. Flip. Let's see let's see how that goes. That was my that was my fake heel flip and uh, actually I was surprised I was surprised uh, how, how the fake heel flip went and uh, next I'm gonna do next I'm gonna do sweet heel flip and uh, usually my fake heel flip is not that good like uh, so I was surprised I was surprised that it went that well so next next step is sweet heel flip and uh, let's see let's see how that goes and usually. Usually switch, usually switch heel flip is uh, kind of easy trick for me, and I do that kind of often. I do that kind of often, and uh, usually I can do it almost, almost every try or every second try. Or usually it's basic trick for me, but lately I have been struggling with switch heel flip and switch kick flip. I don't know why. Uh, but on the other hand, my nollie heel flip and nollie kick flip. Well, actually my nollie kick flip has been also a little bit gone at the moment, but. Uh, Let's hope I can get it back. But now, now let's, let's hope. No, no, let's not hope. Let's see how much it seems to cost. So that was my that was my uh, switch heel flip. That was my switch heel flip, and uh, actually I needed to repeat kinda kinda many times. And usually I like to do it uh, when I have a new grip tape and new shoes, like I like I said before. And uh, next next I'm gonna do null heel flip, and uh, usually that's the that's the easiest heel flip for me. And I save it for the for the last. But uh, now I have been here almost. 88, almost 90, 90 minutes, and uh, I was basically today I was trying to do these sessions and just do basic, basic tricks that I can do first try or five tries and just do one tutorial in 30 minutes or 50 minutes or 30 minutes. But, but the level was level was dropping a little bit again, and uh, it took more time than I was expecting. And uh, but at the end, I'm happy. But some, some landings that, that I did today, and uh, next I'm gonna do nollie heel flip. And usually that's the easiest heel flip for me, and the best heel flip that I can usually usually do. And let's let's see how that nollie heel flip goes. Right, so those those were my different heel flips, and uh, 
like before it took a little bit more time that i was i was expecting and i wanted to do it cleaner and cleaner and uh, uh like i like i said once in a while i'm training some tricks to get it like uh also when i'm when i'm doing a curb tricks or flat ground tricks uh, i'm trying to learn those tricks so like uh like i can do it first I can do it like I can do it first first try or a couple couple tries or get it, getting it a little bit better and better and somehow once in a while the level is level is dropping but at least now here one hour 40 47 minutes and uh, actually actually I was landing almost all all tries but uh, I wanted to do a little bit cleaner and not cleaner but I wanted to do it like smarter and smarter way like uh landing, landing it smarter and catching it catching it smarter and uh just do it a little bit better and uh, better and uh now i'm gonna go back home and do my, do my muscle training and maybe maybe next e episode maybe next episode i'm gonna i'm gonna uh learn one new trick also like i was first planning to planning to do today but my my legs are my back back are so tired so so I was thinking I'm gonna do something a little bit easier today and uh, only spend 30 minutes 15 or 30 minutes today for for skateboarding and also resting my resting my legs and my body but uh, somehow I didn't know and and uh, it went how it went but at least I was I'm kind of happy happy about those tricks that I did and the, all the landings that I did and. Uh, Maybe not the easiest. Maybe not the easiest uh, day to do kick flip and heel flip. Not, maybe not the easiest day to do heel flips when your flip, flip tape is not that good anymore and it's, uh, it's the touch is not that that good. And uh, also, I'm struggling a little bit at the moment speaking English. Also, I had also when the my speaking level is dropping. I don't know how how that. Uh, how that happens so many times but anyway i'm gonna head into back home and uh also do some muscle muscle training and also i need to keep something and uh like i said before I'm, now i'm trying now i'm trying to keep this uh video a lot more about skateboarding and uh sports and food and healthy stuff and but uh also i wanna so I want to say also I want to say that uh, I sent some I was trying to also get some some other jobs this morning uh, sending sending CVs to different, different companies and different, different firms and uh, because this YouTube is not at the moment I'm not earning that much only, only with this social media thing and, and uh, if I if I, co if, if I compare how much effort I'm, I'm putting for I'm, I'm putting for this this for me uh, any, anyway, I'm gonna head in, head into back home, and let's hope I can also. I still believe that I can, I can also get some incomes with this social media thing. But those were my heel flips, and uh, hopefully people can learn something for for those for those for these videos. And uh, I hope I hope people can people can learn learn something. And uh, now I'm gonna head into back home. All right, so now I'm now I'm back home, and uh, also today I did some muscle training and 17, 17 minutes, and uh, you can see see the my muscle muscle training and my workout on my Instagram page. And sorry that I was struggling speaking English at the end in in ready, and uh, luckily now I can speak a little bit better and a little bit easier. And uh, let's hope people really learn something from from those videos that i filmed today and uh maybe i also do one post from from instagram and uh now it's already already 11 uh 42 so uh i'm gonna have a shower and then i'm gonna go to a store and uh i'm gonna do some some pasta or something for for next four days i need to save some some money because at the moment i don't have that much incomes and uh and uh like I said before, I hope I can get uh, a little bit more more money also 
uh, doing this YouTube channel and uh, looks like if I um, if I'm not uh, if I'm trying to do things kind of normally and not doing any crazy accents or, or anything like that people don't uh, look at me that much and I don't get uh, they're not that interested but I don't wanna neither be crazy so I prefer to uh, I prefer to stay uh, um, stable and normal and uh, just do these tutorial videos and uh, stuff that I I want to do by my not by myself but that the things that I want to do how I how I think it is smart 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 way to do it and uh, uh, I'm not perfectly happy about that heel flip I think I'm gonna do that heel flip a little bit better it's just a little bit rocket rocket and uh, usually with old grip tape and uh, old shoes it's a little bit hard to do a uh, good straight good straight heel flip and uh, it's usually easier when when you have new shoes and new board so I think I'm gonna do that a little bit better but uh, also I think I'm gonna do start doing more of these tutorial videos and uh, teach people how to do do tricks and uh, mm, but also I wanna learn some new tricks and uh, and uh, it depends how my day schedule is because uh, today I was feeling I'm super when I was skateboarding I was feeling like I'm super busy somehow I was feeling like I'm super busy like I have so many things to do like I need to film this I need to go home and edit this I need to to work out uh, uh, do some food and also I'm trying to uh, also I'm trying to uh, see some women and uh, do also my civil civil life and uh, that kind of stuff also but at the moment I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of I'm kind of busy and uh, also I don't want to make this episode too long and uh, now I'm gonna have a shower and then I start cooking something all right so now it's already uh, almost two o'clock 13.45 and uh, food is also ready and uh, food is food, food is also ready and uh, like I said before I'm gonna do some pasta and uh, cucumber and uh, some meat and uh, carrots and garlic and red onion and different spices and some bread and pan and uh, some vitamin D and one clement and pure, pure butter and also some, some soda stream water and uh, uh, and, and this was this was today's episode and thank you everyone for watching and and uh, those those were my uh, heel flips and uh, kick flips and now I'm now I, now I eat and I start uh, I start uh, editing this episode and also uh, maybe download some footage to TikTok and uh, Instagram also and uh, hopefully. Someone learned how to do heel flips and kick different kick flips, different kick flips and different heel flips. And uh, thank you, thank you everyone for watching, and uh, see you next time.